Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another Triformin Sports Training YouTube video. I'm Mike Hartman, and today we're gonna to take a look at three exercises that footballers can do in the gym to improve their acceleration. But that's enough talk, let's get into the video. Before we can take a look at the exercises, it's important to understand the relationship of acceleration versus top speed in football. Now, in football, doesn't matter what position you play, what your style of play is, generally speaking, acceleration is gonna be much more important and much more used on the pitch. We're generally working in that 10 to 30 meter distance, and very rarely are you actually going to hit top speed, which can take up to 60 meters to do so. And mechanically speaking, acceleration versus top speed, they look completely different. In the acceleration phase, ground contact times are gonna be much slower, so it's gonna rely a lot more on strength and force production, as well as it's a pushing movement with a lower center of gravity just over the feet. Exercise number one, sprinting. It sounds funny, but one of the best things you can do to improve your acceleration and sprinting is to sprint. Now you're gonna to wanna to do this at least two times per week, doing four to eight maximum intent sprints. So to ensure you're pushing yourself 100%, you can race against a competitive friend or have somebody time you with a clock. Also, as far as distance, stick to about 10 to 40 meters. So we're still focusing on acceleration. Exercise number two, sled training. The sled's great for bridging the gap between technical drills and weight room exercises. It teaches the athlete how to produce force into the ground to move themselves forward while also allowing them to train through hip hyperextension, which is where a lot of power is produced while sprinting. Two great exercises would be the sled march and sled sprints. And with both of these, you can go heavy enough where it does not alter your motor pattern. Exercise number three, wall drills. Now these are great because you can practically do them anywhere and you can do them before a workout or a team training session. And it's really gonna help you improve your acceleration mechanics. A couple cues to think about. You wanna have a 45 degree angle. You wanna keep the core engaged, keep a neutral spine, strike the ground with the ball of your foot. And we're working through rapid triple extension and flexion. Great exercise to start with would be a single leg switches. Then you can work your way up to alternating switches, one, two, three switches, and wall runs. But with the wall runs, stick to about five to 10 seconds, maximum velocity. And guys, that's gonna wrap up the video. If you liked it, make sure you smash that like button below. Be sure to subscribe. And like always, keep working hard, keep getting better. We'll see you in our next video.